Welcome back to Deeply Rooted. Today we are going to be looking inside McQuan's math. So I bought McQuan math because I really like the key two series. They have key two fractions, key to geometry, key to decimals. I used this when I was being homeschooled and I'm using this for my older student. And I was looking for something for my elementary age students. And so I picked up McQuan math. Now I will tell you from the get go, this is not for us. This math, it's the sequencing is very different on it. I do not like the lab sheet <coughs> teacher guide, this thing. It's, I will show you that in a minute, but there are, I will say this, there are some things that I really did like within the workbook itself that did help my daughter. So we used two other books. We did not go all the way through them, but there were some practice sheets in here that really did help my daughter get a grasp on the math. So on that side, I do like it. And this is their yellow book. It's not really done by grade level. Um, and the sequencing for what you're learning is just a little bit different from most math. Uh, this is supposed to have rods that they sell separately. I did not buy the rods, but this kind of like um, math you see, it has manipulatives that you can purchase. So as we open up the lab sheet, I will say that this is not the most teacher friendly uh, material. Some people may like it. This is just not for me. So you have the section. So counting on even addition, it goes down. And then over here, you would have the levels. This is the orange book, red book, blue book, green book, yellow book, purple book. And so basically what this means is you can have a section in here. Think of it as like a chapter where it covers all subtraction. And within that chapter, you have the directions and answer key for from level one all the way through level six in one chapter. So instead of just being able to open it up at, at whatever level book you're on and be able to go and grade, you're going here, you're over here, you're over here, and then on the next book, you're back here again. And that is just not not for me. One more thing I would like to show you is that at the beginning of each chapter, it gives you suggested activities, the equipment that you might need, the preparation, different things. The weird thing to me about this is that remember that these are covering multiple books and you're not doing all of the books at one time, you're doing them one at a time. So I find that incredibly odd that there is so much skipping around so as we turn the page, what you will see is that this is going to mirror what your students are doing in their book. And I find it odd that the answer key, instead of being on this right here, is up here. And there's sometimes instructions or sometimes not. It's just not a wonderful curriculum. You know, I bought this because the Key 2 series is one of my favorite series for math. Uh, however, and this was written by his mom, but this is not set up the same as the Key 2 series, not user-friendly. I, I wouldn't recommend this curriculum. 